There we go. There we go. Who's the world's never ending creation? Be Craft something. I need Severance, okay, Zoria Velas Peru. Craft something. Thanks. Two points, and be quick about it. Oh, please, good sir, a bit of courtesy. So I look up, and Bob's your uncle. He downs half the barrel in one draught. Geralt, over here. Oi, wait your looks. Use the look of a man who knows how to drink. Thanks, some other time. Hey now, don't make me beg. More treats! Show off. Of course I am. Wouldn't you be? Time's a marvelous plaything. And a great spice to use in gingerbread. So, you were listening. 
Indeed, occasionally I find time manipulation irresistible. Controlling it offers so many appetizing opportunities, like spiking the soup of unsavory individuals with appropriately ghastly things. You actually control time, or is this just some conjurer's trick? What difference does it make? A big one. Hmm. Let us say, time has always fascinated me. So, I taught myself how best to use it. Why time, of all things? Geralt, there are four dimensions. Length, width, height, and time. What would you have me fall in love with? <laughs> width? Who are you really? Gauntero Din, also known. Not what I'm asking. Ah, so you'd rather know what it is I do. In brief, I give folk what they ask for. You might say, I simply grant their wishes. That'd be downright noble if you didn't always demand something in return. Law of the market. I was not the one to coin the phrase, nothing comes free. You're not human, that's clear. So what are you? A demon? A djinn? Do you really wish to know? Mm-hmm. Yes. No, Geralt. You don't. This one time I shall spare you and not grant your wish. All who have learned my true name are now either dead or have met an even worse fate. Yet I still need you. So, to what do I owe the pleasure? I wanted to congratulate you. You acquitted yourself splendidly with Olgierd. In fact, you've almost satisfied your debt. Was supposed to fulfill his three wishes. Did just that. This is where you remove the brand, because we're even. Nearly. To fulfill the terms of the contract to the letter, you must do one more thing. Draw Olgierd to the Temple of Ilvani. We never discussed that. Oh, but we did. As a man of the world, you should know that every contract contains a catch or two. Small print, which, nevertheless, changes the ultimate meaning of the pact. This applies to oral contracts as well. Recall that I said, and I quote, I believe, however, that all will end well, and once it does, we three shall meet and thank one another for the voyage we shared. End quote. Mm, yeah, I remember. Fulfill your end of the bargain, and I will remove the brand. That was the last time you interrupted me while I was talking to someone. Ugh. What the devil? Why is there a fly in my suit? Was waiting. Had an eye out for you. Didn't see you come in. How is it you're here? I'm a witcher. Superhuman quickness. Just one of my many qualities. You tossed this fly in my suit? No. Now listen carefully. Tell your Ataman to come to the Temple of Lilvani. It's south of here. Entrance is inside a cave. <coughs> What's the commotion? Lilvani's temple. Got it? Aye, got it. Hold that! Your friend, the medic. Thanks. What did you see? Bloke literally dropped dead. Uh. Blind mm. scoundrel. Shani. Oh, Geralt. Good thing you're here. What happened? Somebody break in? This? Uh, no. Just getting ready to move. What? When? when where to? Uh, 
Not what I wanted to talk to you about. Or at least not only. I'm leaving, Geralt. Never mentioned you'd be... I didn't know I... Couldn't turn him down? Uh, perhaps I could have. I understand. Someday. I'm... So? Well, I abandoned the books quickly. Find anyone? Turned out I didn't need to look far. Apparently, all geared. The professor. Here in Oxenford. Mage? I can't say. He is. What's your guess? He certainly. Me? We'll go. Guards have never stopped. Mm. Wound these, and I'll have to patch them up. Besides, we might run into a friend. So how are things at the Academy these days? You mean since Radovid shut it down? I mean, is it well guarded? Might be all it is. Many of the faculty fled to the far north. The braver ones stayed, but assumed the guises of tailors and laundresses. Why? Just curious. The scholars seem to have adopted mage tactics. They in the same bind? So the Eastern Front, and then? Depends where they send me. Wherever it is, take care of yourself. Always do. So don't worry. Halt! Not even lecturers? No one. Fine. Consider yourself... Hey? Maybe we ought to... Hmm. Here's what we'll do. I'll... How? Don't know. Uh. The Oxford Academy seems to like. Oh nope nope that would have been ed that would have ended badly. Really. But. story but we've done well professor shake witch hunters guard the door doubt I'll be able to been a huge help already it was nothing if you wish to see me again before I go all right mm-hmm
that caught on fire? Ah. Lesser key. Tums about demons, dusty as they come. Franco, I'm Professor. Not gonna hurt. Uh what demon? Finding. Gone to old. He didn't send me. I'm a witcher. <laughs> a mute. Mm, a witcher. Then it follows I needn't fear. I'm hardly a... What did Olgierd von... I curse the day I first set I... He appeared at my door. I... I went so far. In deciphering the ancient scrawlings, I went blind. Yeah. Seemingly huh? What's with this? They... How do you... Said he was honoured I'd take... Ever tried? If you'd heard. Know anything else? Of God. You're alive. Alive. Old Geard sign one. Brilliant deduction. Have you guessed why? You must know that he came from a wealthy, influential line. He must have, if the family of his betrothed. Ex Yet did you know his fortune soured? He himself became an outcast. Old Geard wished to elope. The further away, the better. The iris room. Quite the predicament. Indeed. Their luck turned yet darker when a wandering witch mentioned a solution. Man. The rest follows naturally. Olgird and Old... Olgird was to sacrifice one he loved. Old Dim delights in difficult choices. He knew... Olgird chose. And soon thereafter married his beloved. So did all. No, no. Oh. Oh, Gear, tell you all. He had to. How well? Make it sound like it's worse. Why was all geared? Had he? His heart had turned cold as ice. His feelings for his wife, for whom he'd sacrificed his brother, had withered. He'd lost all. No. Or Dim grants what you wish. Not. Oh. Kill him, you mean? Kill evil? <laughs> Meaning? Oh, dim wheels. Oh, if I ch that, I do not know. Thank. Good. <sighs> mm-hmm.
that's why. Okay. And we go out here. Strange choice of locale. Guessing there's a reason for it. Wasn't me who chose it. I assumed so. But since we're here, I believe you have something for me. Fulfilled the third wish. How do I know this to be the rose? Very well might have picked this up at the Oxenfurt Market an hour ago. Look closely at it. Got it from Iris. It was the last thing that bound her to this world. What? Iris was tired of living half alive, half dead. Thinks she just wanted it to end. Can't blame her. I condemned her to terrible suffering. Iris. What a mess we made of it all. If I'd only known then how it would end. What? What's happening? I feel as though... As though... A hot iron's pierced my chest. Sorry to have kept you waiting. So glad to see everyone's mind. How do you feel, Von Everick? A little less trouble? Lighter in the heart? Or dim? What do you want? What do you mean, what? Your soul. You forget. The pack states you can take it only once you fulfill three wishes and... And we stand together on the moon. Well, what do you know? We had a pact. 
The moon is there. There! No! Here. I gave you what you wished for. Here, on the moon, our contract you fulfilled. Awesome. You cheated me. I never cheat. It is done. Oh! Your soul belongs to me. Oh! At last, it's over. We must meet again one day. Business with you is pure pleasure. Gonna remove the brand? Ah, right away. Done. Now, tell me what reward you've chosen. Don't want a thing from you. Are you certain? I am capable of a great deal. Never been more sure. Goodbye, Odin. Okay. Let me make a marker. That's a necker. Ooh. 
Help protect Ciri from the Wild Hunt, and the Emperor will grant you amnesty. I hope we can trust you. You can. What of Fringilla? That I don't know, but I shall take it up with him. You barely said hello, and you're already plotting something. It's clearly in our nature. <laughs> I hear right. Provided they help us defend Siri. <sighs> Got up. If you can't believe it, don't. Bit about Frangilla. What was that? Triss told me you couldn't contact her. Perhaps because she sits in the Emperor's dungeon. At least that's what Rita implied. How's Rita now? Barely got out of prison herself. She spoke to Fringilla before they imprisoned her. Fringilla said that the Emperor had summoned her and she'd explained what no one's heard from her since. Thought this kind of drama only happened around Radovid. I don't like it. That was not our deal. Come, they're all waiting for us. Oh, I say. Oh, you'd make a fine sailor. Till the puking set in. All are present. Anchors away. Well, that settles the question of His Imperial Majesty's whereabouts. Does he aim to conquer Skelligan? But he, he knows. Those are my friends. He wishes to grant you the Isles, with Sintra and the rest of the Empire. Is that so? The Emperor will have to help us fight the hunt. And we've just found Frangilla Vigo. We must hurry and find the Sunstone. Seems we've plenty to do in Skelliger after that. Fringilla Vigo. We need her here. Can you teleport me onto Amir's ship? Not a chance. It's better shielded than the Emperor's alcove. Though we could try to force our way through. We need Fringilla in one piece. I'll get on the Emperor's ship myself. Plan to swim? With swords on your back? You'll get shot up like a sitting duck before you can say the white flame dancing on the graves of his foes. Don't panic. Make your approach by night. You'll stand up. Show His Imperial Majesty this letter. Hand it to him directly. We should remind him what he promised. At the moment, we don't even know. It was created so the mountain elves could summon the vessels of the NL. Now it may... Truly? Can all of you be unfamiliar with the story of Galban and Dillion of the White Fleet? Talus, please. Absolutely love elven legends. Galban was a sage of the Elder Elves. He fell in love with an Enshe elf, Dillian, yet she spurned him. Ahem. <laughs> that was a jest on Geralt. Too late. It won't hurt any of you to... He believed Dillian's heart would soften in time. Once her longing for him burgeoned, she was to use the Sunstone. The world's away... Sounds promising. Let's just... 
The sunstones and scalp from legends. Elven ones. It lies where... Meaning anywhere on... Ermion. I'll talk. Know where he is. I'll... I'm off. Good luck. And we'll save it here. Thanks for joining me, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.